my setup. Set up and uh, canvas down. Chris is plain. Crack it, eh? Absolutely beautiful. The water's quite low. It's, um, it's good enough to get something. Obviously this bit, this bit here is all someone else has done. And I've just started, we did that, a couple, me and Jade did that a couple weekends ago. And then I'm just starting in this bit over here. That's what I've got at the moment. Sort of uh, still doing a bit of trial and error with it. Something a bit different than most. Maybe it's got little. Um, it's got little. I don't know if you can quite see it, but each one of those is. A, um, a round so it actually acts as a ripple but a really big one up and down and it doesn't really miss anything but, uh, I've got that I've got the pan in there just to make sure but normally it doesn't miss anything at all I don't know if you'll be able to see in there there's a wee bit of gold just there Sticks up there, a bit more over there, a bit over there. I've only just stuck this little mat in here, so it seems to work really well. But looks, just got to figure out the um, flow rate for the top piece because of because I've got quite a different angle between the two. So that's my fall rate, but I've actually probably made it a wee bit too steep and I can't get enough flow over the front, but still catching the gold, so we'll still play around with two little friends. Quite tame new ducks. Anyway, I'll carry on and I'll show you some more Hopefully later on. So it's getting quite a few little bits across the front there, just in front of that rod. You can see those, not sure. Yeah, feel good. Back soon.
here. Right under my finger. And I can see those ones. And the corner got quite a few to see. One there, one there. Got a few flakes all through here. We're onto it. Seems to be working really well. It's only really small um, ripples. That seems to be working really well, holding the gold perfectly. I think it's a bit slow. This this part of the mat's a bit slow because of the angle's wrong. But I'll get that fixed. Yeah, so I'll do a quick update. This was one pan. This was one pan. I'm not sure if you can see all those, but it's going to focus properly. Yeah, there's a couple of good little bits in there. Only small, but that's just one pan out of just one and a couple of shovels. So I'm gonna uh, I'm just still shifting, moving up. Found the gold line. I was over there digging up around there, but it's, um, it's nothing. It seems to have dried up there. But I'm starting to go along here. These two little bits, so it's sort of heading out towards. Well, in that line, basically straight up, straight up through to that log that you can see in the in the distance. There it seems to be a straight line. I think anyway. So. Um, yeah, give you the update. I cleaned it, cleaned out the sluice before, but I uh, put another whole bucket through. And there's some good bits in there too. Don't know if you can see those. There's one just behind that ripple there. You can just see it. And there's quite a few little bits of fines. Another bit just there in the middle of the screen. A bit there, little bits of fines down through there. So I'm really pleased with the mat, and it looks like there's another good bit just under there. So I'm really pleased with the way the ripples are working. And these seem to clear out, so they leave all the heavies in the corners. All that heavy. Um, I think it's iron rock or whatever they call it. So you can see the line as it comes down. So that's what it basically gets down to. Just gets rid of all the, all the other stuff. And leaves, leaves just, just the heavies. Quite fast down this end but it'll still work. Yeah, that seems to be good. Seems to be working pretty damn fine, so... Yeah, the mozzies, uh, sand flies, <laughs> pretty ferocious. There's heaps of them. They're trying to attack me. They're <laughs> going flat out. Anyway. 
This side, keep you updated. Alright, I'll give you another update soon. Well, it's only been a few minutes, and I thought I'd just do another quick pan. I'm just sort of heading, I'll show you where I'm heading. Quite funny, really. So, I've just headed up to that, to that pole just up there. I'm just heading through here, and it looks like it's all virgin ground because it's all dirty and clay and and then I just did a pan out of that while I was spilling the bucket I just thought I'd just test it just to make sure I was still onto it and this is what I got out of one pan don't know how clear that's going to come up I can't quite see but that's one one pan there's probably about 30 pieces in there I guess very fine from very fine to those two good bits over there so I'm storing it but as you can see I'm sweating it out. <laughs> it's uh, very, very hot. And the, the sand flies are killing me. But, uh, yeah, just picturesque here, eh? Just can't fault it. My little, my little ducks are <laughs> running way down over there. But, uh, yeah, anyway. Hopefully uh, Jade might come down tomorrow and give me a hand. He was supposed to come today, but obviously he's been waylaid, so so we'll carry on and, and I'll give you a rundown later on. It's about where is it now? What's going on? Watch his dog. It's about four o'clock, I think. So anyway, I'll uh, catch you soon. Alrighty, later. Just thought I'd do a quick update. Old Jade's turned up. He's going flat out on the... He's dealing to the sluice. Just doing that hole now, we're just cleaning forward of the hole, so we'll just see how we come out with that. Right. Bit of an update going for a while, and we get some really good gold now, so we're just gonna just sort of moved. I've done from over there all the way along there, or over that edge, all the way along there, and all the way along to here. So we're just sort of heading this way over this side somewhere, I think. So, and yeah, we're just gonna just got some more about five or six pieces, seven pieces in behind this um, rock here and that sort of area. So I'm gonna clean that out. And you can just see the bedrock there. Yes, yeah, so still seem to be going pretty good. So it's just. Building the wall. <laughs> yeah, I just know the wall is not Yeah, yeah. Oh, still, still some gold in there. Yeah. Happy with this mat. 
Good on you. Hey, Good on you. What I got out of the out of the Saluce. And it's all heavy, heavy, whatever it calls, iron rocks or something. But it's heavy as doesn't move. <laughs> I will see, I'll show you at the end of this what it looks like. Yeah, it's cleaned it all up. And this is how we did. So not too bad. It was about just about two hours worth. Jade lathering up. <laughs> well, day two. Another crack a day in paradise. Absolutely beautiful day. Someone's effort. Post up. <laughs> Yeah, we're just about to set up back in the same spot. Let's see if we can work this, uh, put the sluice back in. Gonna work this hole again. I think we're gonna come more up this way now. Seems to be more gold on this side, so we'll sort of in here. So we're gonna work up that way, I think. See what we can find. Give you some more footage later on. See how we go. Otherwise, good to go. Right, catch you later. So we're just uh, having another bit of a go, you see some specks in there maybe, a bit close enough. Hopefully that should focus up. But, um, yeah, using, using down here the slime to fill the holes. <laughs> Seems to work. Got a bit more flow today, so it seems to uh, make it go quite good. And then there's this lake there. You're not supposed to be filming, you're supposed to be working. <laughs> you can see quite a bit of gold in there, starting to come through. A couple of nice bits over there. See it 
all flaked up the side of here, but there, sort of heading up that way. Quite a bit along the bottom here, probably can't see in there. Quite a collection of it right through there. And sort of, sort of see the concentration line straight through there. That's all quartz, quartz um, pieces. But as you can see, there's quite a bit more flow today. But I'll sit you up down here and we'll see how we go. <laughs> Paparazzi's out. <laughs> Hopefully, me uh, camera doesn't fall in the water. But it's not waterproof. This one. I'm waiting for the new one to come. Hopefully, that'll be better. Dancing very nicely in there. See it just moving around. I didn't show you yesterday, but um, end up all down through, basically from from there all the way down to the bottom. There was just super super fine gold everywhere. See the good flake just there. Just there at the end of my finger. Good wee flake there. There's a heap sitting on just on the other side there. And just sort of see them as a big pocket of two just there. Two good little bits there. And there's another little bit just sitting just there. Another bit just there. Quite a few bits in through here. One bit there and one bit just uh, there. At the end there. I don't know if it's focusing up very good. Yeah, I'll come back and I'll show you later on. But we're still uh, heading sort of up that hole following where the gold is. So, yeah, be back in soon. All right. So, this is what we got for uh, would have been a couple hours. So not too bad. A couple of nice little bits in there. Yeah. Sort of moved our hole right up to the end there. 
So yeah. Gonna yeah, call it a day and go for a swim, I think. For now. Alright, catch you on the next one. So, um, got most of my um, gold all cleaned up, and I'll show you what I got for the for the end of the well, couple. Well, I suppose what would that be? Six hours work, I guess, over the weekend. All right. Oh, let me show you. So that's what I got. A bit hard to see. And a pretty good effort, I think. A few hours panning. Sluice seemed to work good. I was very happy with that. So I'm going to have another go and try and um, perfect it a wee bit more. But um, yeah. So anyway, see you on the next one. Hope you enjoy. See ya.